And right now at 5, a neighborhood crime alert in Atlantic Beach. New photos just released a few hours ago showing the man police say robbed the Wells Fargo on Atlantic Boulevard this morning. Police say the man is about 5 foot 6. He was wearing blue jeans, a dark t-shirt. And you can see that vest that he has on right there. It says Miller Electric Company printed on the back. Sky 4 flew over the bank shortly after the robbery. Police used canines to search nearby neighborhoods. And today's robbery is the second in this area in just three days. On Tuesday, the Loop restaurant on 3rd Street was also robbed. No one was hurt in either incident. The News for Jacks reporter Elizabeth Campbell shows us how people there are reacting to these crimes. Normally, this Atlantic Beach Wells Fargo wouldn't be closed until about now at 5 p.m., but today it was closed for much of the morning and early afternoon because of the robbery. People who live in the area say after two robberies just this week, they're feeling nervous. Police tape surrounding the Atlantic Beach Wells Fargo Friday morning after police say this man passed a note to a teller demanding money. He ran away after getting an unknown amount of cash. Police tell us no weapon was seen or implied and no one was hurt. On Tuesday night, about a mile away at the Loop restaurant in Neptune Beach, police say this man and an accomplice entered through the back around 930, just 30 minutes after the restaurant closed. One carried an assault rifle the other a handgun. Police say they forced a manager into the office and took money from the safe. Olivia O'Brien and Joe Vivoli live in Atlantic Beach. Vivoli says yeah, not only is it concerning, to, uh, the but they're also spending more money on transportation to feel safe. I'm a little more timid going to work. I usually ride my bike to work and uh, I come home sometimes about 1 30 at night and it's kind of scary riding my bike home, you know. Um, so I've been taking Uber. These two robberies, leaving people living in the usually quiet beaches communities, hoping for arrests and no more crime. The Jacksonville Sheriff's Office assisted in today's search with canines and air units. As for the two men from the Loop robbery on a Tuesday night, we're told by police that they headed westbound on Atlantic Boulevard, which you can see behind me in a silver Ford Fusion. Anyone with information is asked to call police. Reporting from Atlantic Beach, Elizabeth Campbell, Channel 4, the local station.